Today I'm going to show you the throttle and choke linkage configuration on this John Deere lawn tractor. This will be shown today on a Kohler Command engine that's a 17.5 horsepower engine. Now if you have a similar Kohler engine it may be the same linkage configuration. Now I took off the air breather box assembly as you see it right here. There were only two nuts to remove. So I'm going to get right into it. This here is the choke linkage and this is the throttle linkage over here. As you see when I set the throttle lever to the choke position, you're going to see that the butterfly will be closed over there. So that way I know for sure I'm talking about the right linkage. So the configuration is pretty simple. There's only one hole on the choke lever over here. The linkage goes in and it goes down and connects at the back over here. Here's a view from a bit further off. You can see it's connected over here. It goes to the choke lever and that's it. Now I'm going to go to the throttle linkage. Now this one here will mostly only move when the engine is running. As you can see on the lever, there's only one hole for it to go in. It just pops in there. And then you just follow it and it goes to this lever over here for the governor. It goes in the lever, but there's also that piece of plastic to hold it in there securely. It's a very short linkage and it just goes to the throttle lever up here. And while I'm at it, I'm just going to show you the rest of the configuration. You can see the throttle cable comes in over here and connects down on this lever here. And underneath the governor arm over here, you can see that there's a spring hooked into it. It's hooked into the whole second from the end. And that spring just connects up back over here. There it is. I'm moving it right now. So as you can see, it's a fairly simple configuration, but it always helps to have pictures or video like this. Sometimes you may forget how things go back together, especially if it's been apart for a long time. So I'll just do a quick recap before I end off the video. This is the choke, choke linkage, one hole, hooks into there, goes down and hooks on over here. And this is the throttle linkage. There's only one hole on the lever over here. You just follow it. It's a short linkage and it's connected to the governor arm at the back. And there's also a piece of plastic that helps to keep it in there securely. Now it's also good to make sure that your cable is in good condition for the throttle and the choke. It's just one cable that operates both. As on this tractor here, it's only one lever that operates both the choke and the throttle. When it's way up here, the choke's on. When you bring it back, the choke goes off and it only controls the speed of the engine at that point. If you find it stiff, you may want to take it apart, spray some WD-40 or liquid wrench down the cable. You want to make sure that it's adjusted properly over here as well. So thanks for watching guys, make sure to subscribe and I'll see you next time.